From VTV Channel 6 Studios in downtown Vernal, this is Local Point with your host, Chris Piner. Welcome to Local Point on VTV Channel 6. This program is made possible by Ashley Regional Medical Center. Today we're talking about the Dinosaur Roundup Rodeo. And joining me in the studio is the 2008 president, Michelle Miller, and stock chairman, Brett Hancock. Welcome to both of you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Well, it's always fun to, to feature the Dinosaur Roundup Rodeo on Local Point. We've done this quite a bit before. Michelle, you've been here before talking about this. Now, what's, uh, what's up this year? This year, we have a lot of things up. We have um, just a great show for you. We have an awesome grand entry starting off our show. It will be changing up every night, so there's something different about the grand entry every night. different grand entry every night. Different grand entry every night. And just let's slip in the, the dates real quick. When is the, the Dinosaur Roundup Brody and the Boat? Then I'll catch you back up right there again. It's July 9th through the 12th. 9th through the 12th. Yep. So every single night there's a new grand entry. Every single night there will be a new grand entry. All something right. new will be in there. And that's where I cut you off. Yes. What else? <laughs> Well, for Grand Entry, we have uh, we have Wednesday night starting with our skydivers, so you don't want to miss that because we have some skydivers that will be landing in the arena with a huge, wow. huge flag. Is that so. dangerous for the horses? Uh, there, hopefully there won't be any horses no, oh, in the arena. Oh, it's just, arena, the, uh, <laughs> just the, 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 the people skydiving then. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Well, I mean, that would be yeah. something to I see, to wouldn't it? I tried to shoot so. out into the middle of the arena to have one land on a bull, but... <laughs> have them land, at least. No, they don't skydive with the horses. No, I, no. but that with flags and things like that? Um, they won't have any... They'll have a flag that they'll bring in. That is so, always fun to yeah. see, but they'll be able to land right there. That They'll be landing right... We're, we're hoping, hoping anyway. they hit their mark, yeah. <laughs> okay. If they don't, well... I guess we'll just have to hope for the best. We'll hope for the best, yeah. and, and, and people will be forgiving. Well, that, that sounds like something great to see. I've never seen that before. It's it's pretty awesome. I've seen it done twice before, and it is pretty awesome. Wow. So we're hoping it All right. It Anything else uh, that you want to let the cat out of the bag on? And Thursday night, um, we really, we had some support last year. Um, we're trying to get the word out. Thursday night is our pink night, and it's breast cancer oh, yeah. awareness night. Right. And we really, really would like to recognize those breast cancer cancer survivors yeah. um, and have that and a dollar of the ticket sales for every ticket that we sell Thursday night a dollar of those proceeds will go back to the Relay for Life. Ah very good. Yeah and we want everybody in their pink shirts everybody in pink and yeah, this if you is don't a real have a pink shirt pink, right? that's yes. right if you're tough enough to wear pink come on down to the rodeo. Well said. Yeah, well said. So. I, you know I have seen that and that's quite a sight to see everybody. Oh wait and our grand like entry that, it will be pink. Everybody will be pink. Very so. good. You we, too? Yeah, well, yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of a requirement. Yeah, it is. Well, it really is cool, and, and I think everybody rallies around the cause, and uh, uh, it's fun. It is it's fun. fun. It is fun, and it's for everybody to get into. So, you know, we really encourage that Thursday night to come down and, you know, like I said, if you don't have a pink shirt, we'll get you one. Take part you in know. that. You'll actually see contestants that will come out with pink shaps and Is shirts right? and stuff yeah. on and as really well. Take, so uh, it's get it's, into it. It's big, yeah. Great now, cause. Now this isn't the first year of that. I, I seem to recall that uh, running now for at least one other year. It's run for a couple of years. Couple it's of run years. For a couple of years before this year. So I think this is about the third year we've done it. Um, right. Friday night is our heritage night, and that is something we're paying um, respects and our dues back to the heritage of the basin. And so we've got something planned special for that. I'm not going to let that out of the All bag right, yet. All right, so we'll just oh, that's call it. Be good. We'll call that it the heritage be, night. Heritage you don't want to miss night. that. Yep, that's right. for you know our heritage. And then Saturday night is our military night, and that one is also um, we have something really special planned for that too. So nobody does patriotic like uh, cowboys. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's always very, very touching. So that would be another good night. And is that the final night? Saturday night is the final night, and that's when we're having our concert. So we have our concert going on Saturday night. Western Underground is going to come and play Saturday oh. night immediately following the rodeo. All right, there is a lot we want to talk about. We will. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be back in just a moment with more information about the Dinosaur Roundup Rodeo. But first, here's a note from our sponsor, Ashley Regional Medical Center. Ashley Regional Medical Center supports the local community from the Uinta High sports programs to the Relay for Life and the Dinosaur Roundup Rodeo. We work together to make our community a healthy and beneficial place to live. Quality care with a personal touch. Ashley Regional Medical Center. 
Welcome back to Local Point. Here in the studio, we have Michelle Miller and Brett Hancock from the Dinosaur Roundup Rodeo Committee, and we've been talking about all the things that are involved in the rodeo this year. One of the things I find so interesting is that uh, uh, not only do you have the, the acts, and we'll talk about those, and you have the competitors. I know some people come and they, they want to see their favorite competitors, but the, 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 the stock is also a draw, isn't it? Now, oh, this is something that you're, you're working on, one of the many things. It's one of the many Tell things. Tell us about the stock that, uh, that's gonna be here this year. We're very fortunate this year, again, to have Powder River Rodeo, uh, Frank and Lori uh, Franson, as our stock contractors. Um, they've been recognized year after year as one of the top stock contractors uh, in the business, and have always ha consistently had several of their animals at the Wrangler National Finals Rodeo in Las Vegas, Nevada during December. So um, they actually had about 20 of their animals that were at the Wrangler National Finals last year. Now you told me that this is one of the things that makes our rodeo so great. Uh, Michelle, what, what is it again? Our, uh, this rodeo is, is very well known nationwide, This worldwide. rodeo is one of the top five rodeos, has been voted one of the top five eight times. And it's because of our hospitality. They like our community. Our community is great to them. The people here. The competitors just, like to come here. They do. They like to come here. So they like the way they're treated. They like the, mm -hmm. the, the, the quality of the rodeo, the stock, and, and everything is put together so well. It's, uh, I know, something that, that many of us in the community are very proud of the work that you do to make us one of the top five in the nation. Well, it takes a lot of volunteers to do that. You know, there's, there's people that say, well, you know, committees get paid for this. We don't get paid anything it's to volunteer. do this. It's all volunteer. And so you, you kind of love it then, don't you? You've got to love it. You have to love it. <laughs> yeah. That's true. Well, let's talk it. about some of the uh, specialty acts. Is there a specialty act this year that uh, We do. We have a see? specialty act. It, uh, they're the FMX. They are uh, freestyle, freestyle mo motorcycle jumpers. Oh. It's, there'll be bikes flying. Yeah. Wow. Not All one, right. but five. So. Okay, very good. So there'll be ramps and uh, they're going to... Oh, yeah, they'll set up. They'll be up in the air. My son is going to love that. He loves it's a huge the rodeo. Anyway. It's a huge draw. We had a few years back Troy Learwell, which he does a similar act like that. And, and we, the stands were packed because he is so entertaining. And these uh, motorcycle freestylists, it is amazing what they can do with those things. So it's, it's good for everyone. This is going to be huge. Uh, people better get their tickets right away. What uh, what are tickets running, and where do they get them? Tickets are 15 for reserved and 13 for general admission, and they can go to. Now that's per night. That's per night. All right. <clears throat> yeah, and they can go to www.vernalrodeo.com. That is another change that we made this year. We put our tickets online because, you know, with the age that we are now and going into the tech and all of that, you know. It's the way to do it. VernalRodeo.com. VernalRodeo.com. Now, they can pay for them there. Do they, can they? Uh, uh -huh. uh, you can uh, use your credit card, go in and just print out your tickets. Like, print them out you know, online. Yeah, jazz, right. like jazz tickets or, you know, any other tickets. Right. You buy concert tickets, things like right. that. Now, is there, uh, is there a special deal? I, I didn't ask you this ahead of time, but if you want to go all week, is it uh, reduced or is it just the same price each night? It's them? the same price each night. Um, and we have IGA is one of our ticket locations. You can go into IGA and they can so help you. If you don't you have a computer, get tickets you there. can go to IGA. Yeah, you can go to IGA. And also, um, if you call the ticket person at 828 8560, he can help you out getting your tickets. Is that um, ticket person? Does the ticket person have a name or Ed will it Souders. just be? <laughs> okay, Ed Souders. Ed, ask for Ed at 828 8560. 8560. You have trouble getting on, or, or go you know. to IGA or online vernalrodeo.com. Now, tell me quickly what Dyna Bucks are. Dyna Bucks are our new thing we did this year, and we're so excited because Dino Bucks. You've got to get your Dino Bucks um, when you check into the rodeo when you come in to get your tickets. And right, and is that right there at the uh, the booth? We're gonna have uh, four locations. We'll have them at the ticket booths, and then there'll be two locations on the rodeo grounds, the arena grounds. You're going to use those instead of cash this year. Get your Dynabucks and use that for concessions exactly. and other things like That's that. That's for concessions. No no money in concessions. We want to speed up those lines and get people, you know, their burgers and drinks before the rodeo starts. You so. got it all planned. There's so much here to do and, uh, and see. I hope everybody comes to see the Dinosaur Roundup Rodeo, one of the top five in the nation. Right? Right. <laughs> we hope they all come Thanks too. Thanks for coming, you two. And thank you for watching Local Point on VTV Channel 6. You can also watch this program on demand by visiting our website, www.vernal.tv. I'm Chris Piner. Please join us again next time.